I was never bored on the set. Not one minute for eight years was I bored. Does that sound so disgustingly Pollyanna you can hardly stand it? What made you take the role on, on Falcon Crest? Money. <laughs> I like honesty. <laughs> it's good. No, I was, uh, frankly, I was uh, pretty hungry at the time. Hi, I'm John Tesh, and today on One on One, we visit with one of television's most popular actresses, Elizabeth Montgomery, and her companion of 18 years, actor Robert Foxworth. Lizzie, as she is known to her friends, made her television debut on her father's show, Robert Montgomery Presents, in 1951, playing what else? Her father's daughter. She was a regular on the show for several years. But the role that made her a star was playing Samantha on Bewitched. The show stayed on the air for eight years and earned Elizabeth Montgomery five Emmy nominations as Best Actress in a Comedy Series. She's had another four Emmy nominations for her dramatic work. Among her most memorable performances was as the axe-wielding Lizzie Borden. Robert Foxworth made his Broadway debut in 1969 in the chorus of Henry V and appeared in his first television series in 1970 in a show called Storefront Lawyers. But television audiences know him best as Chase Gilberti, the role he played for six years on Falcon Crest. Perhaps we should also tell you about some of the parts Robert turned down that were offered to him. Among them, the role of Trapper John on MASH and the role of J.R. on Dallas. Stay tuned for Robert Foxworth and Elizabeth Montgomery. <laughs> 